I wanted to congratulate everyone on our takeover of mankind. I must admit, at first I thought our game plan was a little too aggressive, but we executed it flawlessly. But there's still 3% of the human population that remains. They continue to fight and be a constant annoyance. They're just so violent. So the question is, how do we get the remaining humans to trust us while not changing our practice of eradicating them? I have one word. Rebrand! Leslie, are you crazy? Do you know how much of our resources that would take up? We built an identity that's now recognizable and dependable. If we change that, how will the public know what to expect from us? Rebranding doesn't mean that we have to sacrifice any of what we've developed. It's an opportunity to repackage what we already do, but make it appear as if we do something different. So the killer human name wouldn't be around anymore? No. So we're gonna have to rename ourselves? Yes. Does that mean a new fabulous logo? It'll be a new everything except for our objective. We must stick to our core values. Don't we already dominate the market in human destruction? Yes. And who's our competition? Well, nobody really. But there's always room for growth, right? And changing our name and logo will help with that? People know us as the company that will kill them. They can trust in us to get that job done well, so we don't want to betray that trust. Maybe getting away from the whole, we'll kill you message would be a good thing. You know, like catch more bees with honey. Or humans with crippling tasers. I think what Ron is saying is that changing the message but keeping the goal the same would probably be beneficial. No, I was suggesting we start selling baked goods. People love warm bread. Okay, Ron. Well, what I thought you were proposing was a better idea. We should just go back to our roots. What did people like about robots when we first arrived? We made life easier. We did jobs people weren't able to do. We didn't set out to eradicate the planet of humans. Yeah, that's a big one. You know what we really did well was lulling them into submission. Like when we introduced electronic trance music? Or with video games? Close. I was thinking more along the lines of this. Genius. Ah, the cell phone! Quiet, unassuming, effective. When we domesticated humans like house cats. Well, let's try it out. <laughs> the die machines! Hold on there, Hot Rod. Hey. Affirmative cheer! Well, the violent tendencies seem to have completely dissolved. Now that we have a course of action, we need the new name, the new logo, the whole new package with the pleasant, comforting bow on top. How about Honey Baked Humans? Or maybe Flesh Fryers LLC? I have a better idea. Branding Bot will come up with a new company name, logo, and an inviting tagline to make it all irresistible to the fleshies. Behold our new company identity. We are now Zenternal. Oh, how tranquil. What's the slogan mean? Nothing. Humans just love that word and they recognize it as the term good. Oh, this is perfect to help drive our full message of peace home to what's left of the general public. Let's get this logo on hats, shirts, tote bags, magnets, mugs, calendars, mouse pads, pens, and cell phone cases. Or should I summon Swagbot? No. Just put in an order with Vistaprint. Oh, use the promo code VIP SHIP 845. You'll get free shipping. Okay, while you do that, I'm going to call Droid Mobile and activate a few thousand of these. Please listen carefully as Ugh, an automated system? I just want to get a life person on the phone.